today I'm doing a haul video. I know I did one a few videos back, but I've been accumulating some items and I really wanted to show you. If I sound sick, that's because I am. I'm actually really sick. Um, I'm on antibiotics and everything, but my nose is really stuffy and I have a really bad cough. I think I might have a fever, honestly. I feel horrible, but I still wanted to film this haul video for you. But if I sound like really nasally, that's why. Okay, so the majority of this haul video is going to be clothes and accessories, but I want to start off with something a little different because I really like it and I've been meaning to show you guys. Okay, so you guys have probably heard of Scentbird because I have from a bunch of other different YouTubers and I thought it was really cool and I want to try it for myself, so I finally did. If you haven't heard of Scentbird, it's basically a monthly subscription for perfumes. So it's only $14.95 a month and you get to pick out a perfume for every month and it comes in this really cute handy vial. It kind of looks like a big lipstick and all you do once you put the little perfume in is you twist up and then you can spray from there so it's super handy if you just want to throw this in your bag. I've been doing that and it doesn't spill or anything and it's like nice and sleek looking. So I chose Viva La Juicy because it's my favorite and I had just run out of it so I thought it was the perfect time to try Sunbird. But there are so many options. I think Scentbird has over 450 perfumes to try. And if you don't know which one you want to try, they have a whole personalized quiz. So you can kind of figure out what scents will be best for you and what ones you'll like. That's something I really like about it. It's kind of personalized just for you. So like I said, if you don't know what you want to try, although I do recommend Viva La Juicy, they have a whole quiz. So you can figure out what you want to try right on there. But anyways, if you do want to try out Sunford, which I totally recommend because I really like it. I've been using this every day, and once it runs out, I'm totally going to get a new one. I have a coupon code. I can't speak, guys. I have a coupon code for you for 25% off. It's TAS25. I'm going to put it here, and I'll also put it in the description box. Okay, so moving on, I got some new pieces from 2020 Ave. I've hauled from them in the past, and I really like their stuff. It's really trendy and very affordable for what it is. So the first thing I have from 2020 Ave I'm actually wearing right now, it's this white and gray striped t-shirt tank top thing. And I think it's really cool. I like the cut of it because it goes really far in here, and you can see my bralette. Everyone always asks where I get my bralettes. They're from Free People, but yeah, so I really like this. As you can see, it's a little bit cropped, which I like. And it's just really comfy, kind of ripped, and I really like this. The next thing I have from 2020 Ab, I was actually wearing in my last haul video, and some of you were asking where it's from, but it's this really cute, just nude colored tank top. It's a crop top once again. It has like a raw hem on the bottom, and then just some buttons up the front. And I think this is really cute, once again, with this bralette and just some shorts in the summer. It is really adorable and just easy to throw on. The next thing I got is another tank top. It's going to be really hard to show off, but I'll definitely try it on for you so you can see what it looks like. It's just this cream colored tank top, but the reason I liked it is because the back is completely like laced up. Yeah, you can't tell at all, but it completely laces up your back and it's just really pretty and this will look super good with the tan. So I thought this one was really cute as well. I got this pair of shorts from them, which are really cute. They're just a little big on me, so I'll probably try and wash them so they shrink a little bit, but they're these really high rise destroyed jeans and they're really cute. I think they're called the mom jeans um, or mom shorts. I'm not totally sure. I'm going to link all this down below, but yeah, these are really cute and they're really high rise. Okay, the last thing from 2020 Ave is my favorite thing and I actually posted a photo of this on Instagram yesterday and you guys were loving it. It's a green bomber jacket and I've wanted one for a while because they're really trendy and I think they're cute and I really like this one. I'm pretty picky and I like this one a lot and it's really affordable. So it's army green and then it has some black detailing on the collar and then the bottom of the sleeves and then there's just some silver zippers with the black detailing as well. And yeah, I just think this is really cute and it's really lightweight so it's fine to wear in the summer. Yeah, so I love 2020 Ave. I'm going to link all their stuff down below and definitely go and check them out. Okay, moving on, I got some items from Shein.com. I've hauled from them before. It's one of those Asian online websites and personally I believe that Shein is the best one. They have so many reviews on like their clothing and then a lot of people have like submitted photos of them wearing the clothing so you can see what it looks like. I don't know, Shein is my favorite one of all like the Asian wholesale websites and they did send me this stuff. So the first thing I got from Shein is not exactly clothing, it is sticky boob pads because mine lost their stick. I was going to 
I was at some USC frat invite and I was wearing sticky boobs and they literally came off like under my dress. I was like, whoops. And I just had to like shove them in my purse. But yeah, I needed a new pair. So I got these ones from Shein. Um, my night had before were more of like a cloth and then they were sticky, but these are literally like chicken cutlets. So yeah. <laughs> the next thing I got is this denim skirt, which is super trendy right now. It's just like literally a denim skirt with like some frayed bottom. Um, I didn't know how I would feel about this, but I thought it would be cute with like, I don't know, a college t-shirt on like a game day or just like some sort of party. I don't know. I just thought this could be cute in a few different ways, so I got it. The next item I got, I was wearing in that same Instagram picture with the jacket, and it's these shorts. I really love these shorts. I think they're so nice looking. They're like a gray, black kind of distressed short really cute these are small a little bit small too i mean i can wear them and they look fine but they're kind of hard to get over my butt um and these are a small so just to keep in mind but i think they're so cute and i would definitely get these in like another color the next thing i got from shein is a two-piece set which is actually really cute i didn't know how i feel about it but i actually really like it so the top is just this little cropped tube top and oops as i throw it and I'm pretty sure it's supposed to go off the shoulder. Um, I mean, I guess you could probably wear it both ways, but it looks off the shoulder. Really cute, it cinches at the bottom. And then the bottoms it came with are these cute shorts. I really like them. They kind of have like some layers in the front and then the tassels. And together, these look really cute and you could also wear them separately. So that's what I love about two-piece sets. I got this blue dress. It's pretty wrinkly right now but I think it's really cute. Anyways, it just looks like this on top. It's blue and then it has a little cut out there and then the back kind of like ties and laces up. You'll see in the try on, but the bottom is just kind of like uneven, like shark bite-ish. You'll see what I mean. I'll probably get this hem so it's just all one leg because this is a little bit long on me, but overall I think this is really cute and I love the color, especially for the summer. The second to last item is this black wrapper, and when I got it, I was kind of confused because the material is a little bit weird, but I actually really like it on. So it's this black romper with a really deep front, and then the sleeves are lace, and they go out like this, and then the entire back of the romper is lace, and I'll try and show you kind of what the material is. Alright, I don't know if you can tell, but it's kind of like... No, it's weird. I just thought it would be more of like a chiffon material, but it's this really like, I don't know, kind of stretchy material. I do like it though. Yeah, so this actually looks really cute on, and I'll definitely be wearing it. The last item from Shein I'm not really a fan of, it's this maxi dress. It's kind of like, what's this called? Um, shoot. What is this called when it's like this on the top? I can't think of it. But it's like that on the top and then it goes down. I don't know, maybe it's because it's really wrinkly that I don't like it that much right now. Um, I think it has some slits in the bottom, yeah. And then there's these little, little sleeve things. Um, so it's like straight across with these little sleeve things. I don't know, it's not bad. It's just not like super nicely made. The seams are kind of weird, but yeah. Okay, I'm just going to show you two more little random things. This top I got from Urban Outfitters, I'm going to wear it to Governor's Ball. If you guys don't know, I'm going to Governor's Ball day two. So if you guys are going, let me know. I would love to see you guys there. I'm going with Gretchen, Gretchen Loves Beauty, and then her twin sister Lucy. So if you watch Gretchen's videos, I'm going with her and Lucy. So yeah, I got this shirt to wear there. I think it's so cute. From Urban, it's basically like lace kind of at the top with like a really deep V. And then it's just like super cropped with like a little ruffle on the bottom and then the back is a really deep V as well. And the last thing I want to show, she doesn't even know I'm showing these on my videos, but this girl Liz who owns Blissfully List Jewelry and I kind of work together and she sent me two pieces from her Etsy shop. She makes the cutest jewelry ever guys, I swear it's so cute. I love all of it, it's so affordable so please please go check her out. Ah! as I'm dropping it everywhere. I'm gonna show you, she sent me two bracelets. 
So the first one looks like this. It's some really nice glass beads and then it has the really cute little Hamza guy on it. And then the other one she sent me, it looks like this. It's the same kind of colors, but it has some gold beads and it's just so pretty. These look so cute on and like stacked and she has so many other really cute bracelets and other jewelry. You can use the code BLISS15 for 15% 15 off her Etsy site, which is such a great deal because everything is so affordable to begin with, but you should definitely go check it out. Yeah, so I'm gonna link her Etsy shop down below and I'll also put her Instagram there. So if you go look at her Instagram, totally comment and say that I sent you because I want her to know I'm so thankful that she made me these bracelets because I think they're so cute and I seriously love all of her stuff. Okay, so that's the haul video. I'm sorry if I was like loopy in it. I honestly feel really weird right now and I don't even know. I'm like jumbling my words. I'm so sick. <laughs> if you guys don't follow me on social media and want to, Fiercely Tasha is my Instagram and Twitter and my Snapchat is Tasha Farsage. I'm gonna put my Instagram and Twitter here and my snap code here as well as in the description if you guys wanna follow me. Okay, I'm gonna go lay down and get some rest, but I love you guys and thanks for watching. Bye.